This thing you just can go crazy on it. Like just go. Don't you worry about it. Just spread it around. There you go. You have the three tube of doing this shit. Yes, uh, in this video, hello my friend, he is Baiano with Baiano Hello. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to soundproof an existing ceiling. And we're gonna use a green glue compound. We're gonna be using a two tube uh, sheets. Alright? <laughs> yeah? Yes, we're gonna do like we're gonna do this the whole seal on this unit except for the closet and bathroom. We're gonna do the the beam, we're gonna do all the drops. All gonna be done with a uh, soundproof compound. This is uh, the green glue would work very good for the soundproof. We've been using it a lot and we have a lot of uh, happy customers. Yeah, it is. Uh, the green glue is a little bit mess to work with, so wear old clothes if you do it, and uh, protect the floor and protect as much as you can, because this is uh, this is a uh, it is a mess mess product to work with. On the other video, we show you the side protection, how we did the side protection, and uh, that's why this place might look familiar. <laughs> This is why this place probably look familiar for you because we just uh, seen it on the preview. If it's not, just uh, check our video for site protection. We will link it. All right. I will show you guys how to use this uh, green glue compound and uh, let's work. Right. Enough talk. Okay, once we prepare to cut it, like you see, it's sealed, so I'm just gonna stop it down a little bit. I just use a, a knife, utility knife, and I just tap it down, that way the glue would move down a little bit. And then I'm just gonna, I just have um, a few plastic bags in here, because once I cut this guys, I want it to go straight on the plastic bag. Okay. okay, so this nose we just cut the size that we like, like you see. So here is how we do it, knock it down and then I'm just gonna cut with the knife. Okay, that is done. Just gonna get this one here. I'm just gonna cut a little bit angle on it. Like, there you go. Then I just screw it on. Just for you guys to see. And here we're gonna use, uh, we're gonna use an average of uh, two sheets, two two tubes of glue, green glue, per 4x8 sheet, but we have here, we have a 12 feet long, so it would be three, three of them, for one 12 feet, 12 by 4 feet. So this is, uh, I have in here is enough for one sheet, 4x8. So here I just use, I just use uh, one of this, uh, the gun, the glue gun, the big one, a cocking gun, the big cocking gun and uh, I just pop this guy in yeah it's brand new looks to be a very weak I pick up one glue gun <laughs> all right there you go this is uh, nice and good good to go 
compound. So we're gonna grip the sheet, we're gonna pre-cut it, and then we're gonna use the green glue. We we'll show you guys. Yeah, we're just gonna test the sheet to see if it fit before we put the green glue on it. Just wants to make sure that it's a prep fit because uh, green glue is mess, so it's good to make sure the sheet gonna fit. Yeah, make sure you're gonna fit that way you put up on the first shot. It's not very nice to have to bring the one sheet with green glue down to do some cuts. We tested the sheet of trial and it works good. Uh, what we're gonna do here, we're gonna spread go crazy with this green glue. We just uh, set it up on the step hose, just uh, that way it works good this way. Easier to handle on the end, so yeah, I'm gonna keep the glue two and a half, three inches from the edge. That way it's, uh, once we full handle the sheet, is what it is, so. This thing you just can go crazy on it, like uh, just doing like that. But you can go in part and very much that you want. It's like uh, you can go crazy, like nothing too much. You can go like just, just like uh, make sure that it's uh, more or less evenly spread. Then you guys can go in part and you like. Just make sure it is uh, evenly spread. I'm just gonna show you. Just uh, you can go like. Here, I'm just gonna go around the sprinkle a little bit. Like, just go. Don't you worry about it. Just spread it around. Last one. Last one for this one. And then we have a way more to do. Like on, on this job here, we're gonna use about 60 tube of uh, glue. Green, some compound, right? It is less than 12 feet because we cut some of it, but it's all good. 
We're just gonna hang this baby up and then go for it. All right. We just use a two inches of screws. This will have one layer five eight plus one half inch and green glue. So you just use uh, two inches of screws, not two inches of screws. And to cut the holes, I just use this uh, old zip saw. This is very good, very good too. So. I'm just gonna put this back just to keep it protected. Don't want anything to hit it. I don't want it to hit the sprinkle head, so I'm just gonna put this one up for now. And here we just go prepare next sheet up. I have one uh, one light here will have the light. By cold we need to put the extension, so we have the extension here. Half inch extension on the box. And uh, I'm just gonna mark it like the center of it. Like we have for here and this. See the wires are down, I'm just gonna make sure I have the wires all up there. That way when I open the box, I don't cut the wires. It's very important too. Um, just make a very body happy. Yes, guys, we're gonna continue in here when all the sealing are done, and then we're gonna finish it uh, with a uh, regular dry oil compound and gonna be painted. Yes, once uh, we have the green glue up, in this job, we're just doing the green glue. Sometimes we do use the uh, green blue sea lunch on the corners but this one yeah the client the client just wants the green glue on the sheet and this is what they want and this is what we do making the client happy yes by the time this is all done it's gonna be some proof from the floor above I say it but what will the thank you guys I love you guys see you soon if you have any question about this video or about this green blue, please leave on your comments. We'll be here to answer it. Thank you. And uh, if you have more questions about sound probing, just leave your comments and we'll be here to answer. Thank you very much and I love you guys.